Cornelius, Alexandria, Louisiana. Please go ahead with your question or comment for Larry Elder. Mr. Elder, and thanks Book TV and everything. Boy, I've been waiting to talk to you. I live here in Alexandria, Louisiana. I don't know if you remember a guy named Louis Armstrong. Are you kidding? Greatest trumpeter ever. Well, yes. There you go. Louis Armstrong said this is the racist city he ever been in, and he was never coming back to Alexandria, Louisiana. So he never performed again in Alexandria. That shows you how racist this place can be. Mm -hmm. But what I want to say to you, as an African American, I left the Democratic Party a long time ago. I'm 61 years old, and um, I used to work for the U.S. Bureau of Prisons at Oakdale. They had the riot there with the Cubans. I came in right after that riot. And um, they got saying the N-word and stuff like that and told them I wasn't going to tolerate that stuff. So they eventually brought a black warden down here and said that I threatened to kill the warden and stuff and got rid of me and stuff. And you're right. If you go to jail, you can't do anything. And so I've been trying to clear my name and stuff. But I want to salute you. Like I said, your father, when you told that story about your father being a tough Marine and stuff, man, that really sent chills through by my bones and stuff. I was a military police officer also. So All right, but Cornelius, I, I, I thank you for calling in. Mr. Elder, any comment for Cornelius? Well, Cornelius, just, just, just thank you for the love. Um, uh, it, it's not a lot of fun being called an Uncle Tom. It's not a lot of fun being called a coconut or an Oreo. Uh, but if that's what it takes in order for me to wake up a few people so they can begin to appreciate the, the freedoms that we have, there's a reason that Cubans are braving shark-infested waters to get here. There's a reason Haitians are coming up here and people from Central America are coming up here to a systemically racist country. It's nonsense. So if that's what it takes, fine.